of Allah, the entirely merciful, the specially merciful, may peace, mercy and blessings of Allah the Almighty be upon all of you. I am Omar Ibn Abid and in this video I am going to show you about Windows Movie Maker and how to use it. So this is the complete tutorial of Windows Movie Maker in English. The same video is available in Urdu on my channel as well. So let's open. So uh, this is the interface of uh, Movie Maker and I am going to show you uh, a short overview. So see, this is the paste and uh, this button is used when you want to paste some audio behind your video ba in background of your video and there are also other options we will see these options one by one so if we come here so we can add pictures or videos by clicking on this button either here or here uh, so uh, there are two options available either uh, you can add a video uh, which you have uh, uh, made earlier in Windows Movie Maker or in any other software and the other option is that you can add pictures and you can make uh, a slide video uh, you can say in which slides are moving and you can make video with the help of pictures and you can add background music as well so if you click on this button so now you have to go to the directory where uh, you want to add a few videos or pictures so I am doing uh, both things at the same time so I am adding this video just for a sample I have made this video I am also adding a few pictures one two and three and I am pressing the button open so uh, in this way uh, all these pictures and audio are available here now if I play this button so when you go here you can listen something uh, which I have added in these videos yeah. This video mein main aapko J quiz ke bare mein bat So like this way. Uh, now uh, you can see a waveform here in this video. Actually uh, this waveform is the sign that uh, there is a sound in this video or any your words or something else like sound so these are the waveforms and uh, you can hide these waveforms as well and now if I click on the button paste so nothing has been added here you can see so for this purpose um, you have to go here to add music or record narration so if I click on the but button add music so it will ask audio micro free music archive these musics are from web similarly add music if you click on the button add music then you have to go to that directory where you have any one of your items now open this and this will be added in this way Uh, now uh, the starting point here is blank and after it there is the sound and this is the sign of sound and in waveform at some places the sound is high at some places the sound is lower so if I go here and play Allahu Akbar Allah So in this way you are listening to this sound as well. Uh, now I am pressing Ctrl Z to cancel what I have added and 
for example if I have moved this cursor here and once again I am going to add music and now I am selecting the option add music at the current point so now you can see the music is added from this point uh, I can also do something else for example if I want to add uh, music for example from from here to here so what I have to do is to move your cursor here and uh, actually this black bar here and go to the button edit and press the button split now you can see that uh, this has been splitted from all these sections now if I'm going here or here I one, uh, once again I can split this video or a section so I may add something in these sections for example here and here you just have to press the button split uh, now in home tab let's see other options as well this is the webcam video if you want uh, to record yourself if you click on this button rec record narration so or add sound so if I am click on the button record narration I may add narration from here just click on the button record May peace, mercy and blessings of Allah the Almighty be upon all of you. Stop. So once you have added a narration, you have f first you have to save it. And once again, just like uh, a music, you have to add it uh, in your video. So in this way, for example, you can see the narration has been added here. And if I play this peace mercy and blessings of Allah the Almighty so in this way a narration can be added similarly you can also add sorry you can also add sound as well uh, uh, what is a snapshot so actually snapshot is uh, this for example I uh, my cursor is here and this picture is appearing in the video so if I click on the button snapshot so this picture will be captured and if I click uh, move cursor here so now you can see this uh, box here if I click on the snapshot now this picture will be captured so for example now if you move to add photos and videos so you can see this picture so this is the snapshot and I have added this as well uh, moreover uh, you can see here title caption and credits credits or director or starring or location or soundtrack uh, it is your choice whatever you want if I click on the button title so uh, this light will be appear mostly because title is at the start so you can move this title to here uh, just like move anywhere you do you want to move like this and now uh, you can also add text here you can also change the font any one of these font you can also change the size bold italics transparency you can also justify line space you can also edit text you can also change the background uh, text duration for how much time do you want your title to be played for example if uh, and uh, what is the start time for example if I click on change this to 4 now you can see this has been shorted and if I play so after 4 seconds it will go away 
so to add text you can uh, just double click on this button now you may add any one of your text for example I am writing Ibn Abid so in this way you can add now if I play so in this way uh, now uh, you can see these animations and just look here and I am going to change animation from here so you can select any one of these animations in your title or any one of your slide so these are the if you s click on any one of these an uh, animations so it will be added into your video now once again go to home so wh what are captions actually captions mean uh, you can add captions to any one of your slide for for example I want to add some captions here so I just can write here and these captions will be added and once again I can change the duration or start time uh, similarly you know credits is almost uh, at the end of every video so you can add credits or director or starring uh, whatever do you want to add you have to click on this starting and now at the end you can also add something here now once again go to the home tab so these are once again the animations different animations you can see here now let's go to this animation section so a few other animations will be appeared here for example I am now open this these are the different it will also ask, ask you apply to all and the duration of animation you can increase or decrease the duration of animation if I go to visual effects so now uh, I can also add some visual effects now you can see the color of books have been changed in this way these are the visual effects you can also apply to all these visual effects if you go to project then you can change the ratio aspect ratio mostly this is preferable 16 ratio 9 for laptops for computers and even for mobile phones as well uh, you can also emphasize music uh, the music will increase a little bit uh, the bitrate will increase a little bit you can also emphasize video quality emphasize narration and audio mix option is also available here if you go to the tab view so now uh, this is the waveform if I click on this waveform so you can now see that the waveform has been hidden once again if I click so waveform will appear again so if uh, this is pr preview full screen you can also do this from here May peace mercy and blessings of all in this way uh, you can just Bismillah Rahman Rahim view your video before making it or before doing it final you can also rotate your video like this you can all see here now uh, if you go to the option to the tab view and you can also zoom in zoom out and if you go to the section edit so here are some important options available so let's suppose uh, you want to silent this music which was already you have added in your video and you want to keep it silent so just go here vol video volume you can increase or decrease it and you can mute it as well so I have muted it so if I play now you may not uh, listen what is happening in the video 
and you can split if you click on this button trim tool uh, you can trim your video as well like this trim this section and save trim uh, start point and end point for example because starting point is zero i can also change this starting point and you can now see and i can also change the end point so i'm not going to trim right now fade in and fade out uh, this option is also available for music do you want to keep your music fast or slow it is also your choice uh, let's pause uh, here is this music and i may fade in or fade out you can also increase the speed of your video like this and this is the option for video uh, stabilization for example anti shake anti shake and wobble anti shake and wobble correction low high so these are all the options once uh, you have edited your video completely now you have to save this project so you can just go here save project so actually when you save uh, your project say for example i am saving it on desktop and if i can look at in my desktop so uh, this is my movie this is your project uh, if you open this so it will open like this the same project now uh, if you want to finalize your video uh, so go here file and there are a few options new project open project save project similarly save project as publish movie if you click on this button publish movie so a few options will appear do you want to publish this movie on one drive facebook youtube vimeo flickr groups add a plugin manage your services now if you click on this option save movie so recommended for this project this is for high definition display 1080p for high definition display then for computer for email android phone large android phone medium you can select any one of the option for example if i uh, click on this option for high definition uh, display so now i can give any name to my video and you can also see uh, save as type so you know this is the format for high definition video you can just save and this process will go like this and video will be finalized so this is all about uh, windows movie maker i hope you would have understood how to use windows movie maker so don't forget to give your feedback and if you have understood this video and if you have understood my other lectures you may subscribe uh, my channel if you like Remember in your prayers don't forget to give your feedback jazakallahu khairan and thank you